Isn't it cool? And I still have room if more worthy branches come my way. We've got another sticky situation down in our ravine. This tree, this tree managed to catch a large falling branch right in the middle of where it divides. It was a pretty good catch, I think. It's a big one. Let's see if I can haul this thing up and out of here and give it to our goats.
Waiting for those goats. While we're waiting for those goats to finish with their latest branch, I wanted to play with some other branches out here myself. You've seen me use branches and stumps and logs artistically out here before. This is just the latest use of nature as art here at Ivy Acres. This branch came from the really large tree that we had taken out from our doe pin back before we even had goats. I think that was one of our very first videos. Anyway, this one always seemed to me like, like a wizard staff, something that you might just see right out of the Lord of the Rings. This next one has also been waiting quite some time for me to use. And I think this one had an appearance in a video I did about mushrooms. <laughs> Finally, this branch was a recent find. I wasn't sure about it at first because it's shorter than what I had had in the back of my mind for what I should be looking for for this project. But you'll see in a moment that it just works perfectly with that second branch. I've screwed on strap hangers. These are what I use in my picture framing business. The branches will just hang as they are on the outside of our chicken coop. There are three basic methods to sculpture. The subtractive method is the one that Michelangelo is famous for. He could see the form in the block and just remove the material to reveal it. The additive method is where you might weld on more metal or glue on more wood in order to create the form that you're going for. The last method isn't used much, but it is valid. The found object method 
isn't cheating. The artwork is simply revealed by displaying an object in a new context. And that's what I'm doing here. Isn't it cool? And I still have room if more worthy branches come my way. It looks like the goats are just about done with this branch, so I'm going to go ahead and chop it up for some chipping and shredding. All gone. Had your chance. Yeah. All right, so doing this stick wall was so much fun. I went ahead and looked through my inventory and found another one that I think is worthy of, uh, of its other companions. <laughs> 